I am Jean-Yves Olivier. I am Secretary General of the Brazzaville Foundation for Peace and Conservation. And you are watching FAK Insider. Africa is a country of the verb, of the words. It's not a country where you write things. It's, it's a tradition of Africa. It happened that some South Africans were scared to see all the history and stories, small and big, linked to the period pre-apartheid and post-apartheid, disappearing with the people who have lived them because they were too old and will die. So they there is an ONG who has set, they set up which is called African Oral History, which role was exclusivity without being partisan to interview people for one, two, three, four, eight hours. They interviewed uh, among some of, some of the stars, but also the people of the street, people who have played very minimal role, thinking that those documentation, those fallibility given to uh, the people will help future historian or universities. They discover in some of the interviews that there was a Frenchman who was doing thing behind the thing and his name was Mr. Jacques. So they, try, they, search, they start to search to, to find who was this Mr. Jacques and they found me. And they were so interested by the, by the, the story that then instead of doing just a tape recording system, they decided to do a movie. That, that's the way Platform Pit came out. I refused. Because uh, I, it was not in my plan. I wanted to die with my secrets. <laughs> but uh, they use very strong arguments that I have duties, that uh, I cannot go like that, uh, and I have to talk. And it took them six months to convince me. Oh, yes, that's many topics, very important. W you know, you were asking me if I was happy. I'm happy that the, this movie has some messages and can be perceived by a very different group of people with a uh, they would get, they would leave the room with having, uh, thinking of something to be done tomorrow. In getting inspiration from the, mo from the movie for their own future. Uh, it's not just, uh, I have seen an story, okay, it's interesting, it was unknown, blah, 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 and uh, let's forget about it and let's have dinner. No, most of the people who see this movie, and this is where my joy is, is that they feel that not only they have learned something, but they can be inspired in the future of their life for what they have learned. Like for the young, for example. Uh, today, uh, there is less and less hope for the young to be able to do something in their life. Here is a proof that you can, you can do something, whatever you are, where you are, provided that you are dedicated and you are... Uh, there is a message for the black American. Uh, where is apartheid? Where is it really handed? Is, uh, is there any parallel between South Africa end of apartheid and, and American end of the, and, uh, the gain of the civil rights? All that comes out of this movie and I found that extremely uh, rewarding for me. I, I think I will be gone from planet Earth with, with, uh, when uh, there will be still injustices in the world and there will be still war. War is not, end of the war is not at the next corner, it's not a lifetime, it's a long process which will, uh, let's try just to reduce as much as you, we can the, the war and the injustice of this world. But don't dream, uh, it will not be uh, uh, finish and, and they wouldn't disappear from planet Earth when you die. There will be still other people who have, will con have to continue what you are trying to do and getting for a, trying to get an, to a better world.